What's going on IG? I'm here with my boy Rami and we're here at Cool Kicks, one of the best consignment stores or Are we consignment buy, sell, trade. We're buy, buy sell, sell trade stores in LA, hands down, especially Merrow's Boulevard. Yes, this sir. is the spot you want to be. So I, I have a few that. questions you got that. as I'm just passing through I got today. You. I got and you. This wasn't something that was set up. It's just I'm randomly here. So, yes, you know, since uh -huh. I'm here in one of the most exclusive stores, I might as well talk to my man Appreciate right here, that, man. so yes, he sir. can let me know and acknowledge, give me a little bit of acknowledgement on some of the good products and some of the good things that they have in here. Yes, sir, I got you. So we're gonna get straight to it. So the first thing that I want, first of all, before we get into all that, what's your favorite shoe? Because you're, because you're a sneakerhead. Your shoe right here. So started off the Black Cement Three. Originally came out in 1988. I wasn't born until 2002, so I didn't get to see all that. Uh, but I mean, they recame out last year, February, and it's just such a classic silhouette. Right here on the back with the OG Nike Air on the back. They came out again in 2011 with the Jumpman on the back, but can't really beat that Nike Air. And it's just such a classic shoe. I mean, can't See, this is what I like. Somebody that works somewhere that knows their knowledge, that knows their shoe knowledge and, what, and what's going on. So you can walk into so many other stores yes, sir. and employees yeah. don't know anything about what's yeah, going on. You. So that's good that for that. So um, if you were to say, I mean, you're, you're a classic collector, but you're a hype beast too. Yeah. Like, you don't have no problem with me saying that. Right? Okay. So what would you say is the most hyped item in the store, hands down? Like, if a super hype beast was to walk in here right now, what item would he go to? Hey, Dre, would you say the off-white Chicago's most hype? Definitely. Yeah, let's pull it out. Yeah, let's Man, look how much heat they got in here. It's hands down. So, all right, we'll start out. This is our back case. We keep all the majority of the most expensive shoes in here. Um, the most hyped item, I feel like everybody's opinion would be the off-white one. This has started a whole, off-white has started a whole new wave in shoes. Um, so we have it marked at, this is a size seven and a half for 4,000. It's a used pair. Um, yes, I know it's a hefty price point. You, usually brand new pairs, we have them at 2,500. And just cause this size, that's why it's a lot more rare. Um, we have, there's a lot more. The Euros, obviously the all-white colorway only came out of Europe. And that's gonna be exactly, that's all-white, so. Y'all know what these are. Easy, yeah, we all know what, we all know what are. these are. It's a lot of hype stuff up in here. I Use, mean, what is it, 2000? 2000 brand new. They that's typically run at 3500 or 4000 What size are they? This is a size, it's a size 10 used for 2000 which is a really good price compared to, you know, I, I and, think you guys know what they go for. And listen, the people that are listening to this, listen. Don't freak out because you hear the price. We're actually showing you the most exclusive items on the street. Yeah. But this, this, what this store is about, one thing they're about, um, looking out for the community. Mm -hmm. So there's so many other shoes that are in this store that are the regular retail price or even actually lower than retail price. Y'all see Yeezys, how much Yeezys go for? We got used pairs at 275, brand new, these are 450. So the good thing about us, I don't know if we're a buy, sell, trade store. So we buy shoes. If you guys have shoes, we also buy. So we buy you shoes pair, you, you shoes too. So obviously used is gonna be cheaper than brand new. Saves you some money and you can get the same shoes everybody else got on. Not, not only that, like like I just got off your your guys' IG. Yeah, page, uh huh. And I seen that you guys have multiple steals on there. Some Jordans for sixty bucks, some Jordans for whole bunch 150 of bucks. This retail. is this is really our newest size thirteen, eighty dollars, Jordan thirteen low. Wow. Eighty dollars, wow. This is wow. My size too. This is a steal. You got eighty bucks? Man, you can't you can't go wrong at all. Maybe worn what, maybe yeah. once or twice. Probably. But there's no hill drag, barely any dirt. This is definitely a steal yeah. for somebody. If you're looking for uh, regular retro Jordans, this is something I would, if you're a big foot cat like myself, and this is actually my size, this may be something that I'm leaving today with. Oh, you know what I did see on there? It's a pair of uh, all red lab boys. 13 for 140. That's sold on Tuesday. That's oh, it's sold on Tuesday. Tuesday. Yeah, I was yeah, hoping it was here because I was about to buy it. That's four days ago. I don't know how I know that, but I know that. They right, Tuesday. right. So as you know, I'm a really big classic collector. Classic so, candy. yeah, let, let me see some classics, man. Let me see. Uh, I want some tip me with something. All right, well, something. I mean, the back case is really for the heat. The classic is probably going to be on the wall. So. Okay. This shoe don't need too much explaining. DB fives. Um, um, I don't, if you guys don't know about the Dornbecker, so pretty much what Nike does and Jordan Brand, they uh, from the Dornbecker Hospital, they they get kids that are ill or are sick, and they let them design their own shoe, and it's such a good idea, such a good topic, and what are they going for? Eight hundred, brand new, for a size twelve. That's not big. It's not bad at all. But you got like some Whippies or some Barclays or some pennies or something like that. 
Do we? Um, you guys do have the classic Kobe ones. We do. With the actual retro eight on the side. 81 point game. Can't, can't really beat that. Mm -hmm. It's definitely a classic. But your boy has it already. You know I had to have this already. So I already got this in the play. As you can see, I got the freshwater grippies on my feet. sir. Um, first Jordan of all time, red ones. We got a lot of ones. Um, everybody loves day ones. That's our Jordan one section. We got a whole bunch of them. What else? South Beach is real classic. Yes, my favorite shoe in my whole collection. Right with the pink laces on them. Can't beat that. How That's much are they going for? Brand new. I would say probably what, thousand dollars? Seven hundred. Seven hundred dollars. That's a steal. It's DS too. Undervalued, yeah. That's brand new. This and it's brand new DS. <laughs> Can't really beat that. Yes, sir. Definitely not. Yeah. What about these? Uh, I mean, I know it's a height, but it's still on the up tempo. These the up tempo, right? okay. So, um, y'all know about too. the up tempos. We don't really carry in the basic up just because they don't sell too well, but we have the Supreme Joints, which is they go for 550. That's not um, bad at all. Yeah. They, what retail is like what? Almost two hundred. Retail, I believe, was one something like that. After tax, it probably came out of like two two twenty. Yeah, like, like two two twenty. That's what it's but they, they was only going for three four hundred when they first came out. Yeah. Now the red one's going for more than a thousand, brand new. These and the black ones settled at like five six hundred. This is nice. Uh -huh. Fire. Heat, you guys. All right, so I see all the heat and everything over yes, here. Sir. Now I do see on this wall that you actually have a lot of GS sizes and stuff. GS, like. so all our GS sizes are gonna be in the front. Let me take you okay. out to them. Yeah. I got Let's you. Go ahead, let my man yes. lead us over there to the GS sizes. And it's very important because you know women, women are sneakerheads too, and they have small feet. So the GS is right up there. This is our GS section right here. I mean, um, everything sizes four through seven is gonna be. Of course, we got yeah. off whites too. All the off whites. Look, What's off -white. this? Okay, a lot. All the off white that you can think about. Take you to the other side. We got all the sixes. We got a lot. We got a lot. It's still, you guys come in here, you're gonna get a steal for something. If you're a type of person that just likes to spend bare minimum, they have bare minimum product for you. We got stuff from under 100, we got Jordans, we got designer, Balenciaga, Gucci, which is oh, slides. Wait, you can't beat that. that? Can't. Which we sell those? Slide. We sell these at 140, so that's what oh, we Oh, wow, 140 for some? Yeah. Well, oh, that's not bad. It's a size seven though, but we got that's that. not bad. Yeah. I would need a pair so of these. Now you can have these size is seven. Question. Yeah. Now I, I I don't I know a little bit about them, but not enough. You could probably and you know you probably help uh, yeah, you. enlighten me more. All right. So now it looks like a basic band to me. It does with a thunderbolt. Exactly. So what it is, Ian Connor, um, his brand Revenge Storm at least. It's pretty much a rip off of a van with a thunderbolt, and he's gotten sued in the past before. But I guess they he did what they had. He had to like change the color of the bottom, add something change the back tab also to make vans it went yeah. after him yeah he at first it was i'm pretty sure he was doing them by himself he was literally getting pairs of vans and customizing it himself to wear then that's when he started the brand so oh started okay started, yeah. so they basically told him you got to have yeah, your exactly, own production exactly. you can't so just take had, our product yeah, exactly. and take the logo exactly on. exactly stitch their so that's what happened okay. that's what happened because I've been seeing yeah, them for uh -huh. a good, good amount of money. We sell them 220 for these. Oh, two, uh, that's 220 cheap. 220 brand new. We don't have different colorways. The LA exclusive ones behind you going for a little more like 250. Yeah. So listen, bro, there's something over here that caught my eye, and I think I know what it is, but I'm about to walk up on it, and I, I need you to tell me a little bit about it. What is this? Ooh, I mean, my it, bad. Okay, all right. What we have? All right, so. It looks like a vest. It's a bulletproof vest. Okay. Um, wow. So it's a it's a lot of weird swag trends going on, and this is one of them. But it's pretty much a bulletproof vest. We sell them at 150. We got a whole bunch of different strips you can put on them at the other store. Display only, not for resale. We got our really, logo on does it. Does it really have the the bulletproof? What? Yeah. Does it? No. Nah. You can buy that part online, okay, but okay. this this is the I was vest itself. Yeah. This the vest itself. <laughs> this, 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 this the vest itself. Um, but we just got our own little, put our own little spin on it, selling them. They sell real well. This is our sure they are. Yeah, they're definitely swaggy. Yeah. And I can. I, I know you guys have two locations, and yes, I know that do. this isn't like your this more is clothing. This is our shoes. I will yeah, definitely, man. man, I appreciate everything you're doing. We're going to wrap it up. Appreciate you, man. But uh, definitely, how can people get in contact with you besides knowing that you're on Marrow's, the most popping shoe store on Marrow's? Cool Kicks LA on Instagram. My personal Instagram is going to be the sneaker icon. Y'all want to check me out. Appreciate you guys coming by, man. For real. You guys have a good one. That's what it is. Appreciate y'all.